Tonight, a warning from state transportation officials as holiday travel picks up. Recent data shows people are driving faster and that is causing more deadly car crashes. In fact, the number of deaths is up 16% compared to this time last year. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Christian Colon is joining us live from Rocky Hill with more on this morning. And Christian, numbers are really on track to break records here. Yeah, they are from speeding to driving and texting and then you add the pandemic stress to it. So now you're aggressively driving. So transportation officials say just take a deep breath and focus on safety. Holiday travel has started and so has the chaos. I feel that people are driving very fast. They don't slow down. They don't slow down for stop signs merging on. They're always going just three lanes. We've almost the other day someone almost just merged into us because they're not looking. DOT is urging people to be extra careful this season. As of November 12, 290 traffic related deaths have occurred in the state. A jump since last year where 257 traffic related deaths happened in 2019, 216. So when they were crashing, they were dying as opposed to just having serious injuries. That trend has continued into 2021, where we have excessive reckless speeding on our roadways, really unacceptable behavior um, on the roadways. It's because people speed or drive impaired. Nationwide data shows about 20,000 people have died in car crashes in just the first half of the year, an 18% jump from last year. To avoid any more, DOT says if you plan on party, the Uber is on them. $10 off an Uber ride. Um, between uh, starting tomorrow and running through January 14th between the hours of 5 p.m. and 4 a.m. to encourage people to get a ride home. Um, they just have to use the code save the night CT. And state police also says they are stepping up patrol because they're noticing more people are driving drunk or at times they're using drugs. They also say that if you see anyone driving recklessly to call 911. In Rocky Hill, Christian Colon, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Christian, thank you.